Hey Libra, welcome to my channel and welcome to your May update. We're going to find out what's going on in your life for May. Please remember that this energy is just general, it may not resonate for everyone, okay? So let's get straight into this Libra and find out what's going on for May. Okay, Libra, so I'm definitely getting that there's this um, energy of you wanting to take things to the next level, okay, with something here. You're wanting to move things forward, okay? Um, I'm definitely saying that you may be wanting to get married, okay? Or, like, your goal is to definitely settle down or something, okay? I, I keep getting, like, that you want to get married, okay? You're at the point where you're wanting to get married, you're wanting to find somebody to commit to, okay? Um, you're wanting to move things on, go to the next, like, stage, okay? Yeah, okay, so I am getting this sense of you wanting to, again, take things to the next level in life, okay? So you may be ready to, um, you know, find somebody to settle down with, have children with, get married to, okay, um, but I do see that there could be somebody here that you may be seeing, some, seeing or something, okay, I'm not seeing a lot of love here, I, I'm not seeing like a lot of um, genuine feelings, okay, it's just like you wanting to settle down, if that makes sense. You could be dealing with a Leo. I, I keep hearing 40, okay? Somebody could be 40, okay, or something like that. Um, let me know if that resonates for you. Yeah, so it's like you have your eye on somebody here. The thing that's missing is sort of love, okay? I, I'm just going to be real with what I'm saying. Like, you feel like you could build the love, okay? But... I'm getting that this person's not really who you're supposed to be with. The person that you're wanting to move things forward with, Libra. Yeah, this person, okay. Hmm. You're dealing with somebody that... It's like they have no direction in life, okay. Um... They definitely have this um, energy of wanting to take, okay? You may give this person a lot. This is not going to resonate for every single Libra, but this is a very specific message. You could be dealing with a Gemini or a Leo. Yeah, there's this sense of you wanting, you know, to take things to the next level, but this is not who you're meant to be with. Like, this person's not very loyal, okay? I'm going to be straight up with you. They're not very loyal, okay? In fact, they're going to cause conflict in your life. They're also going to, like, sponge off you, okay? So if you have a lot of money, like, they can see that. Um, they also feel like that you're really stable, you're set up, Right? This person doesn't have pure intentions when it comes to this. It's like they're looking at what they can gain, right? <coughs> you may not see this at the moment, though. You may not see this because I'm getting that Again, there's this, like, emphasis on you wanting to take things to the next level, you wanting to settle down. There also could be somebody here that, like, you have, like, a connection with, like, they have your heart, but it didn't work out. And now it's like you're trying to replace them. 
and take the energy how it resonates. It could be the other way around. It could be your person. <clears throat> yeah, I'm getting that you feel like you feel rejected by somebody. You feel rejected by somebody that actually has your heart. So now you're trying to replace them. Okay. And again, this could be your person. Take the energy how it resonates. I do see like a very strong energy of you being disappointed because you feel like the person that like has your heart is not seeing this connection or not showing up. There is a sense of you trying to find another option, but your heart's not in it. Yeah. You may be fighting with the person that you really want to be with. And now it's like you've just got somebody there, right, where you feel like you can sort of replace them, okay? Like they're showing interest in you, but there's no love. You may know this deep down, but you're pretending that you can make things work with this person, right? You, you think you can make things work with this person, but it's not the path that you're supposed to be going down, Libra, okay? You could be dealing with an Aquarius or a Cancer. A lot of this is you feeling rejected in some type of way or you feeling like this person did you wrong and now you're really determined to like replace this person to find somebody else again you you, you have like there's somebody here that you may be talking to but you don't feel that for them So this could like, so you're, you may have been in a marriage or something and they could have like cheated on you or brought a third party into it. And now it's like, you haven't really healed from that. Yeah, I am getting a lot of third party energy. Yeah, and um... It's like your dream here is to basically be, like, have a happily happy family, right? You want a happy family. You want to be happy. And things didn't work out in the past, okay, with somebody that you thought. Yeah, something ended here in the past, okay? And I'm getting that... There's a sense of you wanting to get back at somebody as well. Again, take the energy how it resonates. Could be your person. <coughs> it's like you want to get back at them, right? Because they, and they realise what they've lost here. Don't worry, they realise, okay? They feel like they've caused a lot of conflict and made the wrong choice. Yeah, but they feel like that, um... Yeah, you would never, ever, it's like you wouldn't want to talk to this person again because you feel rejected by them in some type of way. They caused a lot of pain here for you. Again, um, I'm getting that you could be seeing other people trying to move on from this person, but it's just making you feel like trash, really, because you're realising that Instead of healing, you're trying to replace, okay? Yeah, you're not over this situation. Whatever happened here, you feel a strong connection here with somebody, okay, that hurt you. Um, you feel rejected by this person. 
and you're not healing from it. You're trying to like numb the pain, okay? Try trying to find somebody else, okay? But the thing is, you need to heal. You need to stay single. You need to heal, okay? So stop rushing things. I'm hearing, okay? You may be trying to rush into something because you want to be happy. You want the happily ever after moment, okay? But this is not the way to go by it, okay? You need to heal, okay? Um, don't worry about other options right now. Take a step back. I'm hearing have a bubble bath, okay? Definitely do cleansing, okay? Because right now, you're trying to, like, numb, if that makes sense. Like, you're trying to find somebody else, okay? So you can have this happily ever after moment. Very rushed. Okay, I'm hearing that... Um, your heart is closed off as well, okay? Your heart chakra, you need to work on your heart chakra because somebody caused you pain here. There was an ending here that caused you pain. And, yeah, you feel like you were really vulnerable to somebody that rejected you here. I do see you pretending you're happy, pretending you're good. It's like you're covering up. It's like a band-aid, okay? It's like you're putting a band-aid on top of this pain and trying to find somebody to... But the thing is, if you don't heal, you're never going to trust anybody else, right? Yeah. You're very closed off right now from the person that you love. It's like you've closed off your heart. It's like you don't want to deal with it right now, okay? But make sure that you're healing, Libra. Make sure that you're healing and not trying to replace, okay? Because if you're putting a band-aid over this and not going through the healing process, then old shit just going to come up in the next relationship, right? Like you have this thought up. Very defensive right now because of what this person did to you, this person that you love. Like this person that you love, okay? You feel rejected by them. You feel like they unwanted, I'm hearing, Okay? Um, that they do not see your worth, okay? Don't forget, darling, you are the empress, okay? You are. And this person, even though they had your heart, they may not have seen your worth at the time. Um, but it doesn't mean that your worth is any lower. You're the empress, okay? There is no one above you, even in this other person's mind. They were going through the lessons themselves, which is why this, like, rejection happened. But don't forget, okay... There's a lot of people that would love to be with you, okay? But just make sure that you're healing from this situation and not trying to pretend you're happy, not trying to, you know, play happily ever after with somebody that is not ready to commit, somebody you barely know, um, just because you want to move things to the next level because all you're hurt, like the only person you're hurting here is yourself, right? Like you're sabotaging yourself. You have a serious wall up, okay? It's like you're in defense mode right now. Wow, okay. I do see that, okay, this could be a twin flame. Like you guys are meant to be together. You guys are meant to be together here, but there's a lot of pain, a lot of rejection, a lot of betrayal, okay, somebody's hiding their feelings, pretending they don't feel the way they do, yeah, somebody pretending not to see this connection, because of their ego, okay, this person's got a massive ego, they're also a manipulator, but they're your divine counterpart, okay, and they're going through lessons right now. You're dealing with somebody that usually acts this way. They don't show their feelings at all. They actually try to come off as somebody that sort of... Whoa. I do not like this person's energy. They try to come off as somebody that's emotionless. They don't care who they hurt, okay, they're seriously in their ego, they, their ego is very big, um, uh, it's like they reject feelings, okay, so I'm getting that you came at 
them and, you know, you triggered their feelings. So they rejected you because they reject their feelings, right? Somebody, yeah, As this person is going through lessons, they're going through an ego death right now. Um, you're dealing with somebody that's very set in their way. Um, inflated ego, they think they're more important than they, they actually are here, right? I'm hearing don't overcomplicate things, okay? You could be... This person's learning lessons. This divine masculine's learning lessons right now, okay? You're ready to settle down now. Um, and again, you may feel a sense of rejection from this person, so you're trying to find it with somebody else. Don't overcomplicate things, okay? Focus on your healing first. Before you make any decisions, okay, to go any further because I can see that yeah your intuition is telling you this okay but you are walking away from your intuition right now looking away from your intuition because this person triggered some type of like feeling of rejection in you right yeah you're literally trying to find somebody else but this is not the right path, okay? Spirit is in your ear trying to tell you to... You're looking away from spirit at the moment, but... Right? There's a very there's a very stubborn vibe here. You may actually have met somebody that you feel... You know, is a really good person. Um, yeah, but they're definitely... It's like they're trying to paint a pretty picture. They're definitely a dark person. You, it's like you don't want to bring a, another person into this right like right now, okay? Because this is not going to end well. Um, it may look pretty right now. But, yeah, this person... I do see that you're realising that your heart's not in this, right? You're realising that, you know, you want this new beginning, there's this person here, but your heart's not in it. Um, I do see you looking away from your intuition right now because it's hard for you to have faith because your divine masculine is over here rejecting you, not showing up, pretending they don't feel the way they do. They are learning something at the moment. They're going through a strong karmic lesson. Right? Yeah, this Divine Masculine, they're stressing over you at the moment, okay? They can't stand the way they've acted towards you. Um, they are going through an ego death. They're in this very nervous mode as well, okay? Um, but they do see you talking to somebody else. And this is putting them in a darker place because now they feel like they've lost their opportunity, right? Um, all right, so that's all I have for you, Libra. I really hope this resonated for you. If it did, please let me know in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.